Hi everyone, I just wanted to come in and make an update on the Nicola Bully case. As you can see, Nicola Bully's family has hit out over the appalling speculation over her disappearance. And this comes after Lancashire Police had released the information that um, Nicola had had issues with alcohol in the past and was struggling with going through the menopause. The symptoms of menopause can cause you know, issues physically and emotionally. Um, brain fog is one of them, hot flushes is another, and depression and other issues with um, mood swings can also um, occur as a result of going through the menopause. Police have come under criticism for how they have handled this case and many believe that this information would have changed their search including Peter Folding um, who said he didn't know about the vulnerabilities that Nicola had been facing. They have said that Nicola would not have wanted this information to be shared but they wanted to help stop the spreading of false information speculation that has sort of followed since this information has been released. Following this information, um, people have started to come out of the woodwork saying that they're going to sell stories about Nicola to different newspapers and news sources, which is absolutely not on at all. Um, if you know Nicola and you have had contact with her and some form of relationship with her, threatening to tell her story um, is absolutely not okay. And you know, you can get into trouble. And I would hope that if information like that was released um, that trouble would obviously follow the people releasing it. It's not okay to threaten anyone with information on their loved ones in cases where they now think that you know that they can get some kind of clout from this, some sort of payment from this just because some more information has been released. Um, so you know that is where we are at now. There are people threatening to sell stories about Nicola and that is just not okay.